Hey, hey, welcome back to Ron's Tech Hub. And in this one, I'm going to show you guys how to share files from OneDrive. Now, this is one of the really nice features about online storage platforms like OneDrive and Google Drive. You can upload files directly to there and share it with multiple people without having to send those files and emails. Let's get started. So the first thing we have to do is find the thing we want to share. So let's share a single file first. There are a couple ways to do this, so let me show you the first way. I'm going to share that one called Bookscan. And to do that, I'm going to tap those three dots in the right hand corner of the name. And from there, it's going to come up with these options here. I'm going to choose the first option that says Share. Tap that. And from here, I'm just going to simply type in the email address of the person I want to share this with. So in my case, I'm going to share with Ron's Tech Hub, R-O-N-S, Ron's Tech Hub at gmail.com. I'm going to press that, and it's simply going to ask me now to send. So this person is going to get an email with a link that takes them directly to this file. They'll be able to download the file, but they won't be able to edit the file. If you want people to be able to edit the file, you're going to have to tap that one that says people you specify can view. When you tap that, it's going to open this link here. Now, I've hidden some stuff because this is actually my work OneDrive. I didn't log into my personal one. And if you want people to be able to edit it, tap that box. So tick that box that says allow editing and specific people. I normally leave it to specific people so that not anyone can go in there and actually delete your files. I'm going to click apply here. And from here, I've already put the email address in. I'm just going to click send. Now that person is going to get an email address, an email, sorry, that person is going to get an email with a notification that says, you have been sent this file by so-and-so, please click the link to view the file. That's one way to do it. Now, what if you wanted to share multiple files at the same time? It's a similar process, but now we're going to tap and hold on the things we want to share. So that's the first one there. That's the second one, third, fourth. And in this case, we're going to tap that icon at the top that looks like lines and three dots. And it's actually going to download these files temporarily. And from here, I can share it via email. Okay. Now, if you wanted to share an entire folder, that's really easy as well. That's really handy. So one of the reasons I do this, let's say I upload photos of me and my friends. We've been out somewhere. Rather than sending individual people individual photos in WhatsApp, I can simply upload everything to one folder and share it with as many people as I want, even people that weren't there. So I'm going to click and highlight the one that says video backups, for example. And again, I'm going to tap that share icon at the top. When this is going to come up, it's going to say loading. And again, you're going to be able to type the email address of the person you want to share this with. Right? You can just copy the link as well. So that first option that there that says copy link, you can click that and you can copy the link and send it via WhatsApp, a text message, any way you prefer. But I'm going to do the normal way, which is to actually send the link via email. It's going to be runstechhub at gmail.com. And then again, I want people to be able to view and edit. So I'm going to tap people can view and edit. And I'm going to allow editing where it says other settings. And now anyone with this link will be able, or anyone I type into the email address will be able to edit these photos, meaning that they can download them, delete them, move them around, add effects if they can do that. I'm going to click apply. And then I'm simply going to click send. And now this person or these people are, are going to get an email stating that they've been sent this folder by someone and they need to open it to view it. Thank you guys for watching. That's how you share files and folders on OneDrive from mobile.